Kamala Harris's election, odds increase on poly market after Tuesday night debate. Donald Trump election, Kamala Harris. As of now, Harris and Trump are locked in a tie, each holding a 49% probability of victory. Last updated September 11th, 2024 at 1114 GMT. Author Ruholamin Hakshanas. Author Ruholamin Hakshanas about author Ruholamin Hakshanas is a contributing crypto writer for Crypto News. He is a crypto and finance journalist with over four years of experience. Ruholamin has been featured in several high profile crypto author profile share copied last updated. September 11th, 2024 at 1114 GMT3. Why trust Crypto WS? With over a decade of crypto coverage, Crypto WS delivers authoritative insights you can rely on. Our veteran team of journalists and analysts combines in-depth market knowledge with hands-on testing of blockchain technologies. We maintain strict editorial standards, ensuring factual accuracy and impartial reporting on both established cryptocurrencies and emerging projects. Our long-standing presence in the industry and commitment to quality journalism make Crypto News a trusted source in the dynamic world of our digital assets. Read more about Crypto News. Vivek Ramaswamy talks Kamala Harris and crypto ahead of the 2024 presidential election. Vice President Kamala Harris's chances of winning the upcoming U.S. presidential election have surged on poly market following her debate with former President Donald Trump on Tuesday night. As of now, Harris and Trump are locked in a tie, each holding a 49% probability of victory on poly market's 860 million prediction market. Tuesday's debate, the first and likely the last between Harris and Trump before the November election touched on key national issues such as the war in Gaza and abortion rights. Crypto absent from debate, notably cryptocurrency was absent from the topics of discussion despite growing interest in its potential or regulation. Despite this, betters on poly market gave Harris a significant advantage with 94% believing she won the debate, although official polls are yet to be released. In the 24 hours leading up to the debate, Harris's odds on poly market rose from 46% to 49%, while Trump slipped from 52% to 49%. Trump has been outspoken about his support for the cryptocurrency sector, whereas Harris, while engaging with the industry, has not yet taken a definitive stance on the matter. Bitcoin's price mirrored the unfolding debate, experiencing a slight fluctuation. In the hours leading up to the event, Bitcoin briefly climbed above $58,000, but as the debate progressed, it dipped to around $56,700. It has since stabilized at $56,797. Justin DeAnathan, head of APAC Business Development at Crypto Market. Maker Keyrock observed that the crypto market did not react significantly to the debate. He noted that Bitcoin behaved like a typical risk asset, moving in line with tech stocks and other equities. Dinathan added that Bitcoin is awaiting a more concrete catalyst, such as a shift in Federal Reserve policy or a significant political development to trigger a substantial price movement. Meanwhile, politified tokens tied to Trump and Harris saw immediate reactions during the debate. Trump linked token Super Trump Strump with a market cap of $13.8 million, dropped 6.8%, while Kamala Horace Kama declined 5.7%, according to data from CoinGecko. MAGA, Trump, also saw a slight decrease of 0.2%. Bloomberg to integrate poly market election odds into terminal. Earlier this month, leading financial data and news service provider Bloomberg LP revealed that it aims to incorporate election odds data from the crypto betting platform poly market into its widely used terminal. Poly Market, a blockchain-based prediction market operating on the Polygon network, has become a prominent platform for tracking real-time election odds. The platform allows users to bet on a wide range of event outcomes, leveraging transparent on-chain data and smart contracts for trade execution and payouts. According to Dune Analytics, Poly Market's trading volume for August approached $450 million dollars with nearly $760 million bet on the outcome of the U.S. presidential election as of late August. Last month, five United States senators and three House representatives called for a ban on betting activities. 
linked to the upcoming 2024 presidential election. The bipartisan group consists of prominent figures such as Senators Jeff Merkley, Richard Blumenthal, Elizabeth Warren, and Representatives Jamie Raskin and John Sarbanes. Among others, the group expressed concerns over the possibility of billionaires leveraging large wagers to sway election outcomes, thereby eroding public trust in the democratic process. Follow us on Google News.